Shopkins in a cereal? This is a long dog. I'm not crying. I'm not crying. That's just hot. Are you going to have a heart attack over here? Or? I just want to lick that ice cream. <laughs> what are you? YouTube, how's it going? My name's Jason. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Here on this channel, I do a lot of food and product reviews. Today, we're looking at Shopkins, Cudio's apple and strawberry cereal. Um, just happened to be walking through. I was looking for a different cereal today. The giant Reese's, Reese's Pieces cereal, the giant ones. So I'm gonna be doing a video on that. I found that and I saw this and I was like, one, I had no idea what Shopkins is. So, so I, I picked this up immediately, went over to the toy department to see if I could figure out what Shopkins are. And obviously if you're watching this, you probably know what they are. Um, I couldn't find them. Um, the Walmart I was at didn't sell these. Maybe I'm looking in the wrong section. I was in like the girls section of the um, toy store and I didn't see anything. So I had to look it up online and they're like little miniature figures that are shaped like different things. And they have their own, basically you can buy little sets with supermarkets and stuff that have, uh, what do they call them? Little Littles, Little Littles, like actual name brand stuff, but that's really tiny. And the characters, there's so many different ones. Like apparently there's 11, let me see, 12 seasons of these. And I'm just on this one season. And let me just read off some of the, the families. So there's like mom, dad, two kids, and a little baby of each of these, I think. So there's five in every family. You got the Jelly Nutsons, the Juice Wells, the Scoopers. So like the Scoopers are all shaped like different ice creams. The Juice Wells are, look like different drinks. Who else do we got? Sweet Cakes, the Bread Shaws, again, and I'll throw up some pictures of these if I can find them online so you can see as I'm saying the bread shawls, they look like the O'Lallies. And I'm, I'm guessing these are all just from season 11 because that's what I'm clicking on. The Sweetsons, the Bumps, the Crackertons. You get the idea. Just little miniature figures that are shaped like foods or different things. So now they have a cereal from Kellogg's. Apple and strawberry cutios. So just little round, almost look like Apple Jacks or something. Um, but here's the, the thing that draw me to this is apple strawberry. And I'm trying to think of any other cereals out there, especially like the sugary ones aimed for kids that are flavored apple and strawberry. Obviously you have strawberry ones, like I'm thinking like um, Frankenberries, which are strawberry. Um, apple ones, you have apple flavored cereals, but a mix of those two, if you know, let me know in the comments below. I can't think of any that are out there or that ha have been. Uh, do I have high hopes for this? Not really. Most of these gimmicky cereals like I've been doing on here look cool, sound cool, but then they lack in flavor. So we'll see about this one. So cut out your favorite characters. So they got little characters on the side here you can cut out and a little crossword puzzle back here. Actually, this opens up. Oh, that's kind of cool. So it opens up into, which I haven't looked at it yet. Just like a little park scene. You got a lemonade stand, a van there, uh, some tables with people, characters sitting at it. So I guess you could cut these characters out and play on here. Open the back, collect all three play scenes. So I guess there's three different of these scenes. So maybe if you're at the store, you can just kind of pop it open and does it stick right back? Yeah. So you could uh, pop it open. It's, it's got the sticky rubbery substance there. So you could see which scene it is and find the three boxes that have the scenes that you want and you can stick it right back. So there you go. Cutio or Cutios. Yeah, what is Cutios? Shopkins apple and strawberry cereal. So let's try this out and see how these taste. Definitely a strong strawberry smell. Let's take a look at a couple of these colors on here. 
red and green, um, Christmas colors. Like I say red and green. They look pretty cool. What was the color? I did that uh, Elf on the Shelf cereal. Was that? I'd have to throw in a clip of that. I don't remember. I don't have it here. I'm thinking it looked like that. I mean, this looks like it should be the Elf on a, Hel Elf on a Shelf cereal. That wasn't very good. So let's see how this one is. So apple and strawberry. Subtle. Let me just try getting all of one flavor in them. So let me do a whole spoonful of the red, which the red should be the strawberry. try just doing green. See if I can tell any difference in the taste between these two. And I'm not. I mean, It's good, not great. The taste is there. You do get, again, like with most of these, it's so subtle, the, the flavors, the strawberry and the apple. Like with the smell of it, when I opened it up, I thought you could really smell it. I thought it'd stand out more, but when you, like the first bite, okay, you get more of the flavor, then as soon as you start eating it, I'm not tasting as much now. And it gets soggy really fast. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this one. Because it's such a unique flavor. One more bite. Just to see. So. <sighs> cool concept. I like the concept of this flavor. The apple and strawberry. I think it really had potential. I think the word to describe this is lackluster. Like with most of these, these gimmicky cereals that Kellogg's just keeps doing, they throw different names on them and different, uh, based after different shows or characters or whatever. And they just, they lack in flavor. And that's what this is. It's, why can't they make these cereals have a stronger flavor? Really stand out, really taste the apple and strawberry in them. And not after a bite or two, you're like, hmm. I mean, cause after a few bites, it tastes like every other cereal. You know, you, you start losing the taste of it, and it's just this, every, Fruit Loops, all those ones. Ah, Fruit Loops, Fruit Loops stand out and tricks. Some of those, like those, have stronger flavors than, say, this. <sighs> so, disappointed. Definitely disappointed with this. I'm going to give it a thumbs down. Like, I really wanted to like this. I really thought this could be really cool. Strawberry apple but i mean really all i'm getting is the strawberry flavor and it's not a super strong flavor like frankenberries is more of a strawberry taste than this <sighs> like i think if you put this in milk and put it beside some of those other ones probably the elf on the shelf maybe the god which other ones any of these circular shaped cereals they're probably all going to taste the same after a few bites. It's just... Pass. That's what I'm going to say on this. You can pass on this one. This is... A miss. Not a fan of this. Another one that's going to sit here and... I doubt anyone's going to eat this one. Mm. I'd have to go look. Is it all... Is it Kellogg's the one that's missing on all these? Or is it other brands too? That I've been doing... No. Because some of those Captain Crunch cereals have been a big bust, too. Oh, well, so there it is. Shopkins, Cutios, Apple Strawberry, Lackluster. 
that's the best word I can say with this. It's just lackluster. Let me know in the comments below. Have you tried it? What do you think of this one? Did you like it? Or were you kind of disappointed with it too? That's the way I feel, disappointed. So like I said at the beginning, guys, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I upload a new video. I will see you guys next time. And hit that like button.